we started Don't Cook Your Balls pretty early on in the company. And I, the, the credit goes to my, my colleague, co-founder, Sarah, who's really been the driving author and developing the content. But the idea is we realized early on there wasn't a good resource out there for education and information on this topic. If mm -hmm. you start to look up male fertility issues, you come across a lot of hospital websites, WebMD, you know, websites with bullet point after bullet point telling you the facts. We wanted to go after it in a much different way. The fact is that this is a topic that's very difficult for people to talk about, right? You're talking about sperm, you're talking about testicles, and guys don't want to go there. Hey, listen, they're sensitive, literally and figuratively. <laughs> you know, like your testicles are sensitive. That's why they say you Extremely get kicked sensitive. in the nuts. And people are sensitive about their fertility. Are men more sensitive than women, do you think? Is there any research on that? Uh, I, are men I, more squeamish? Just, I don't know if there's research. I think definitely in talking to people, men are much less open to talking about it until you break down those barriers. It's interesting. Once you kind of get over that hump and start, you know, men start to get thinking about it. Oh, that's interesting. And especially if you come across someone who's gone through fertility issues, they, they get it, right? Mm -hmm. They get it. Yes, this is a problem. No one was talking to me about it, but this is something that I needed that I wish I, wish I had. So once you get over that hump, I think... Men are open to talking about it and get really inquisitive. It's comprehensive. It's what you need to know about male fertility. So it's facts about the biology, what happens, but it's also tips for what you can do to actually make an impact in your own reproductive health. So the, the, the overarching messages are one, male infertility is pretty common. You know, okay. this is a much more common condition. Than so don't feel bad. Exactly.